I had an interesting experience uh, in the Come Follow Me uh, uh, program that the church has. It was Sister Holland and I were studying, and I want to leave a testimony with you about the delight of the scriptures and the value of being in them because uh, it can take you from one scripture to another scripture to another scripture that you hadn't planned on. We're, you know, we're reading the Old Testament, and that's introduced us to the Pearl of Great Price, which not enough of us read. And I was studying in the Pearl of Great Price, but came across another verse that wasn't in the Come Follow Me uh, curriculum. But here's the verse, and it had a tremendous impact on me. This is from Moses 7. And it came to pass that the Lord spake unto Enoch, and told Enoch all the doings of the children of men. Wherefore Enoch knew and looked upon their wickedness and their misery, those two go together, and wept, and stretched forth his arms, and his heart swelled wide as eternity, and his bowels yearned, and all eternity shook. I I don't know why that verse had such an impact on me. I've read it before, but the idea of a prophet conversing with God and sensing the mission and opening his arms and opening his heart and all eternity shakes. Maybe I feel stronger about that in my role than, than an average Latter-day Saint would, but I'm going to try to weep for people's misery and open my arms to all eternity and see if I can make eternity shake. I think that's what an apostle or a prophet's supposed to do, and I'm touched by this example in doing it. I love you. In the name of Jesus Christ, amen.